3DS is the, it's a communication protocol that um, enables consumers to authenticate with their card issuer uh, in the context of card not present, CMP uh, transactions. So it enables uh, the three domains, um, to uh, the three domains being the acquire domain, the issuer domain, and the interoperability domain. Uh, it enables these three domains to have this uh, strong or this authentication. Um, so the cardholder authentication based on the, on the card or the, the card uh, issuer, and uh, so it provides um, this authentication and uh, um, avoid the use of uh, fraudulent CNP transactions and uh, the fraudulent use of the card for this card uh, card not present transactions. And 3DS was first launched when. So the 3DS 1.0 uh, was, lo was launched a long time ago. The, the 2.0 version is coming and it's planned for the end of the year uh, with, uh, with uh, additional, additional features. And, and what, what is the new in the new version? Yeah, so we've seen, we've seen from the market that there was a need uh, to announce the existing version of the 3DS specification uh, to support the new, uh, I mean the new technology, which are mobile and mainly the in-app payments. Um, as well as the already supported web browser type of payments. So the 3DS, uh, the, the, the 3DS 2.0 specification, um, I mean, is the result of this, uh, and uh, we, we really wanted to provide uh, an announced uh, risk-based um, risk management and, uh, for this authentication to provide a frictionless, uh, frictionless flow for the user. So what we are doing is really um, to, to first to enable these new, new channels through mobile or other connected devices mm -hmm. as well as uh, providing a um, uh, frictionless consumer experience. So we discussed a lot at Mobe Forum the, the, the need to, uh, to focus on the user. That's what we are doing with Vico and this new 3D Secure 2.0 Specification. There are a lot of, of new features, but the, the, the two really important ones are, are those, those new features, which is the support of in-app, mm -hmm. as well as web, web browser, and the enhanced security that we are proposing. Uh, it's an open spec, so anybody can use it the way he wants mm -hmm. to, mm -hmm. uh, with total, so all the specs, or just, just partially, uh, that it's up to them to, uh, to decide the way they want to use it. And, and you said that the new version will be launched uh, this year already? Absolutely, the new version will be launched uh, before the end of this year. Mm -hmm. uh, we have been working uh, a lot on, on getting inputs uh, from, from the industry and, uh, and from the potential users and implementers uh, in order to announce the specifications mm -hmm. and take into account their, uh, their feedbacks and their inputs. Mm -hmm.